Hi, I'm Pete, founder and chief nosh of Great American Nosh, where we live by the mantra, eat, drink, savor. So thanks for joining us today. It is a weekday and I really don't feel like going crazy with cooking today. Um, and there's a lot of you that feel the same way. There's a lot of recipes that uh, are, we just throw aside because we just don't have time to do it. We're busy, we work, we have kids, we have after school activities, whatever. Anyway, so today we are actually going to cook a recipe from this book, uh, America's Test Kitchen, which I am a huge fan of. Re-advertising, again, I'm throwing my weight all, all around the internet. Anyway, we are going to look at their chicken tikka masala recipe, and we are going to use one of my favorite appliances, the crock pot. Oh, I love this thing so much. And I know a lot of you out there love this as well. This is a saver for us. This has made so many great meals, I can't even count. So, let's get to it.
right, folks, the moment of truth. Let's try this out. It's been uh, in the slow cooker for about uh, three hours. Um, I added the yogurt uh, later on and also the cilantro. And I added a hollow a habanero versus a serrano chili. So we got a lot of levers we played with here. Um, but you know what? America's Test Kitchen usually does me right. So I'm going to try it right now. Here's a moment of truth. Not bad. I think I need a little salt. It's a little, I wouldn't say bland, but plain. Probably needs a little more zip. But other than that, the chicken's tender, easy recipe to make. Um, they did the crock pot in three hours. You could probably do a longer cook if you didn't do all the microwave stuff and everything like that to have a cook all day. It might be a better option, but you know what? This is fantastic for the busy person. Eat, drink, savor.